Sports leagues are shutting down, movies are being delayed, music is being pushed back. It is becoming very clear who the new kings of the entertainment world are. It is us, YouTubers! Settle in everybody, let's have some fun. Throw your cares aside for the next 25 to 30 minutes. Let's just have some fun! But if we are gonna talk about the Sorona virus for just a second, is it a hard C or a soft C? See, I can make jokes because I think I had the coronavirus. I'm not 100% sure it was the coronavirus though because I didn't go get tested because I don't have health insurance. My thought process was, ah, I'll probably survive. And I did, so it's fine. <laughs> We're gonna watch Frozen 2 today. Or not, did the corona take out my internet? It's felt like a while since I've done a Disney movie. Also, can you hear I'm a little stuffy still? Snow? There's gonna be snow in this one too? That's like no enchanted forest I've ever seen. Are you sure about this? It's time they know. <laughs> it's time they know. What if he killed someone in an enchanted forest? Far away, as north as we can go. I buried a body. <laughs> His name was Vladimir. He was part of the Russian mob. A fire of water and earth. There was once a master of all four elements, but when he was needed most, he disappeared. <laughs> no, Elsa. They're fucking benders. Built them a mighty dam. Damn! Stand tall, Agnar. Agnar? <laughs> we let down our guard. Uh-oh. Betrayal. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he fell in love. He fell in love! You little preteen Agnar. What's, What's his name? name? They were attacking us. Get behind me. It was a brutal battle. Really? It doesn't look brutal, because no one has died yet. Your grandfather... Father! ...was lost. <laughs> His dad fell off a cliff? Eh, you and Simba get to Dad's Dead Anonymous. And someone saved me. Well, that was nice of them. Whoever saved you, I love them. <laughs> yeah, you do. It's your mom. That's why she can bend. She's a, a bender like her mother. And we must be prepared for whatever danger it may bring. This is not like a bedtime story. Ah, oh, my father died and the forest was overrun by a curse. Sweet dreams. No, just tell us in the daytime. Let them process it and have other things happen to them in the day that they can dream about. Now all they're gonna dream about is nightmares. Bet. Will you sing it for us? Please? Of course, this is a musical. <laughs> I gotta be honest, I'm a little bored. How far are we in? Six minutes in? I've seen a whole movie, that's the backstory. And then within the backstory, there's more backstory. It's like Inception. It's like, oh, we're gonna go to the past, and then in the past, we're going even further into the past. So she's queen again? Your majesty, oh. they're ready. Uh, still not in control of her powers. Do you hear that? Sounded like Tarzan a little bit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Enjoying your new permafrost, Olaf? Wait, 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 wait. Permafrost? You can just gloss right over that. Permafrost. So she just has mastery over her uh, abilities, yet when she gets spooked, <laughs> she freezes her hands to a railing. Oh my god, not this guy. Not this guy. <laughs> you couldn't get a haircut in between the first and the second one? What a waste he is. He's not hunky at all. I don't fantasize about him <laughs> too often. The one argument you can make for him is that at least he stays by Anna's side. He came to her rescue. But to that I'd say he's loyal because she's the best he's ever gonna do. And he knows that. So he has to protect it at all costs. Because if Anna's not with him, who do you think's getting with this guy? He'd probably marry his fucking moose. Down on one knee. He's proposing to his moose. Yeah, but I'm really bad at me. Look how disgusted she is. That's what I want to do when I see him on the screen. Maybe you should leave all the romantic stuff. Maybe you should leave all the romantic Why? Why do you have to sing like a doofus? Like how reindeers are easier. Reindeers are easier? In what way, sir? This man lived on a mountain by himself selling ice with his, with his fucking moose. What does he do about his needs? It's all he knows. Oh, God. Oh, I thought he was gonna crush the dude's head. Then he could have said, Yoo hoo, big head blowout. <laughs> That's funny. I'm holding on tight to you. That was a. Uh, not a great transition. It felt like a very made for TV. Usually it's a lot smoother out of a song 
and into real life. Monster. Brown bear. Mm. Angry. Monster. Greatest mistake of your life. We didn't even kiss you. Lightning round. Ice cream. <laughs> Castle. Oaken. You got this, Elsa. Tree. This scene is so fucking boring. <laughs> this scene is so bad. You gotta give me something. Um. Bro. What is happening right now? There's just a long charade scene. Am I missing something? Did I click on like a, just like a, a 30 minute special? Like a frozen Christmas special or something? They're playing fucking charades. No kids want to sit here watching animated characters play charades. I'll check on her. Hi. Thanks, honey. Love you. Mm -hmm. He got some thin lips too. He can't be a pleasure to kiss. Look at those lips. We need to lop off this little mullet he's growing. We're gonna have to stop that. He's wearing a carrot scarf. Problem number two. Problem number three, I... <sighs> Give him the Kylie Jenner lip treatment, okay? Inject them bitches. I know what you need. Come on. Bro, this feels fan-made. I just put my finger on it. 15 minutes, nothing's happened. It started with backstory. There's some weird transitions, like they don't know what they're doing. And also like, because they're fan made and they have a small budget, they just use the same sets. Like we're back in this bedroom again. Give me some differing sets. Give me some interesting stuff to look at. And also, can we move this goddamn plot? All right, go cap that singing bitch. All right, if it's gonna bother you, go cap her. <laughs> I can hear you. I didn't say anything. Oh. Oh, is this a song where I got hurt? Misoa showed me this song, cause she liked it. And then I was dancing along to it to be funny, and then I hurt myself really badly. <laughs> Yeah, this song's sick. My power flow. Don't you know that we are This is the first part of the movie I've enjoyed so far. This song, this number, it feels very Disney, very magical. Oh, this should have been five minutes in. No water. The earth is next. We have to get out. We have to get out. That was poor line performance. Oh no, I'm gonna blow! That's what she said. That's what she said! I know it sounds crazy, but I believe whoever is calling me is good. Look at our kingdom. I know. It's just that my magic can feel it. <laughs> That's such a cheap cop-out. I can feel it. How? My magical powers that have never really been explored or explained? How do you argue against that then? She could just be like, oh, that, that person there? He's a bad person. How do you know? I just met my magical powers feel it. And then the guy's like, no, what? I'm just doing what? I'm just, a, I sell tacos. I j I'm a taco vendor. I hear judging me and shit. I'm just trying to sell some tacos. To your goddamn kingdom. I hope you're prepared for what you have done. I feel like these were supposed to be more iconic. They're just not at all. Like when I see them, I'm a little bit disgusted. Poor toe having feet. Gross. Gross. We could sell toys with them and stuff. Like no, no one wants a goddamn rock with four toes. What does all of this have to do with Arendelle? Let me see what I can see. Let me see what I can see. You couldn't have wrote that line a little bit differently? Let me see. When I can see with my sight. Uh, by the way, this has gone full roast. This has gone back to until you hate yourself. I just never thought I'd get here again. I didn't think I was gonna hate this, but I kind of do. You are not going alone. Anna, no, I have my powers to protect me. Excuse me, I climbed the North Mountain, survived a frozen heart, and saved you from my ex-boyfriend, and I did it all without powers. So, you know, I'm coming. They're both asleep. So, what do you want to do? He's like... What do you want to do? I think now is a good time to introduce you to today's sponsor. And that would be my longtime partner, Audible. If you don't know what Audible is, it is the number one destination for Corona isolation entertainment. <laughs> they have thousands and thousands of audiobooks, one of which was a story crafted by my friend. It is called Dark of the West. It is phenomenal. I helped edit it. You should go listen to it. If you go to audible.com slash Dylan is in trouble or just text Dylan is in trouble to 500 500, you are gonna get one free audiobook and then also two free Audible originals. 30 day free trial. There is nothing better than listening to an audiobook while you clean up that corona infested, dirty apartment of yours. Use my code, find a story that you love. I will recommend Dark of the West because I had a hand in crafting that story if I don't wanna. 
pat myself on the back. I'll leave a link for it in the description. Now, ugh, I'm getting so hot. Let's get back to Frozen. You'd have to be crazy to want to marry a man you just met. Wait, what? Crazy? You think I'm crazy? Wrong. So you're saying I'm wrong for you. What? <laughs> I feel like that background could have been prettier. Look at how boring this background is. Browns? You chose browns? Make your movie look pretty. Like this, this is pretty. Colors, lights, sparkles. Oh, damn. Every time. It will be every time. I promise you. Damn! <laughs> Can we see it again? Well, if that damn broke... Damn! Nothing's gonna happen to Arendelle, Anna. It's gonna be fine. Different circumstances? You mean like with someone else? What? Just in case we don't make it out of here. Wait, what? You don't think we're gonna make it out of here? No. What? I get you want to do this running bit of him flubbing his proposals, but you just make her an insecure girl. You think I'm crazy? You think maybe you want to be with someone else? With another girl, we're not gonna live. It's like, shut the fuck up. God damn. She fucking braved a mountain by herself to save her sister. Can we not have her be like this neurotic, anxious girl? You think I we're could... gonna die? No, 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 no. I... Where's Olaf? Uh, he's a lost. Let her go! Let her go! Can't tornado her anymore! Wait, how did she not freeze them? Oh, they look like moments in time. She froze moments in time, but not people? Yo, what are her powers? Yeah, water has memory. Is that their mom and dad? That's father. This girl. She's saving him. Lower your weapon. And you lower yours. They've been trapped in here this whole time? Why would nature reward a person of Arendelle with magic? Perhaps to make up for the actions of your people. So you're telling me that this man has been trapped in this forest with the other people where they're in close proximity to each other. For 30 years, this man has been holding on to this resentment. Just wanted to point that out. <laughs> Yo, homie just ditched his in-laws. To be honest, smart move. <laughs> it's just the dumb shit that's making me laugh. Just the way he like skydived out of her hands. <laughs> you don't want me to follow you into fire, then don't run into fire. You're not being careful, Elsa. When will Elsa learn? Elsa has literally almost killed Anna indirectly and directly on numerous occasions. It was our mother's. Oh, wait, did they just reveal that the mother... Yeah, oh, okay. Oh, that's the mom. Oh, shocker. It's mother. Oh, my God. I was never going to piece that together. Some of us were born in here. We've never even seen a clear sky. The name's Ryder. Ryder? Flynn? <laughs> Flynn's child. Flynn had an affair with a fucking forest person. Holy shit, maybe the grandma? I'm Honey Marin. Honey Marin? Honey Marin. Flynn seems like he would love honey. That's his inside line. Hi there. My name is Flynn. What's your name? Honey. Hmm. That seems right. You know, your eyes are as sweet as honey. <laughs> you know, air, fire, water, and earth. There's a fifth spirit. Uh, the Avatar. Why do lullabies always have to have some terrible warning in them? <laughs> I wonder that all the time. Are they gonna make Elsa a lesbian? I mean, it makes sense though. If Honey did have an affair with Flynn inside this forest, she experienced peak masculinity. There's nothing left to explore from men. Everything else is a disappointment. So it would make sense if she then switched to women. Dylan, that's not how sexuality works. Shut the fuck up. Where are Kristoff and Sven? They left? Mm -hmm. Choose, choose. The princess left with the queen. What? Wait, what? He got left behind! She chose her sister over this doofus! You coming with? I'll just, uh, yeah, I'll meet you there. Okay. Reindeers are better than- Ah, oh, don't give him a full song. Is this like an 80s song? Yes. The answer is yes. I honestly would rather have Anna end up with that prince from the first one and live a miserable existence than for me to have to put up with this man. <laughs> He really told that dude to go on ahead of him so he could have a whole ass musical number. 
Yeah, it's not Marco Polo. Pretty sure. Is that a pirate ship? Oh my god, it's their sunken ship. They're gonna find the corpses of their family. Can it be? Oh, I, I, what is it? I, I, shit. Water has memory. I wanna know what happened to them. So she can literally look through time now. <laughs> oh, water can make noise too. Oh, they drowned. <laughs> Suckers. Better than getting the corona. So we go to Atahalan, not we. How many times do we gotta go over this? The dark sea is too dangerous for us both. No. Dog, how many times are we gonna have to watch Elsa be like, I need to go alone? And then Anna be like, no, we're sisters. I can do this. No, we do this together. Remember the song? Let me help you, please. What are you doing? That was the absolute dumbest thing. Cause you know what Anna's gonna do. She's now going to chase after her, put herself in danger trying to catch up. Oh, God, Elsa is so annoying. She promised me we do this together. Yeah, she's a fucking terrible person. Good job, Elsa. You put your sister into a river of giants. She's gonna get snorted up like she's a line of cocaine. Kokana. Kokana. This girl sucks. You suck, by the way. I hope Honey is straight. Because you don't deserve a love interest. Oh, you're gonna do something badass to make me like you. I'm gonna do my best to not like you, though. Yeah, that's cool. Ah, oh, she tried to American Ninja Warrior that shit. A fucking water horse? Ride that shit. Oh, you getting fucked by a water horse. <laughs> that was such a sad horse cry. Is that an ice lasso that she just created that bends? I don't know any ice that bends. All right, you got three of the spirits. Why is the water spirit a horse though? Why not a seahorse? What a boring background again. Every inch of me is trembling. Every inch of me is trembling. And not from the cold. It's from the orgasm. This movie's a lot less beautiful to look at than what I remember the first one or just any other Disney movie. But you don't have to hide, show yourself. I am They're like, what are the coolest things we can have Elsa do with their frozen powers? What if she moves frozen columns of ice that have fallen over? So cool. She has three of the spirits. So the earth spirits, I'm sure that the uh, the giants are gonna have some sort of influence, uh, and I think Anna's gonna get the Earth Spirit and finish it off or something. Even that was boring. I thought that was gonna be something really cool. I was really excited for that. It was like a giant explosion. I thought it was gonna be colors and vibrance, but it's just like blue. Grandfather makes them think they can defy the will of a king. We welcome you, our neighbors. Oh, he's not dead. There's no way an evil guy enacts a plan and then dies in the first leg of executing that plan. He is still in this forest and he is still yet to die. No! Oh, no, you need Anna's help. Shocker. That's my grandfather. The dam wasn't a gift of peace. It was a trick. We have to break the dam. Uh oh, Olaf's dying. I'm flurrying away. I think I don't feel so good, Mrs. Nana. <laughs> you know, I'm not that sad because I know he's coming back. He's getting recreated. What do I do now? Just go home. <laughs> oh, where's Ice Boy? Uh, he's gotta. Uh, he's gonna come in, save her, then propose. As a gravity, it pulls me down. Whispers in my mind. Can there be a day beyond this night? Get the fuck up. God, this song is so boring because you won't move. She's been singing for like a minute, minute and a half. And she's just now getting up. And now she's sitting down again. This movie just feels like such a decline from the first one. Damn. <laughs> Almost forgot. Come and get me. No. What do you need? Shut the fuck up. I hate you. My sister gave her life for the truth. Oh, you just know your sister's dead? God, death is so not permanent in this movie. She came back in the last movie and she's fine now. Throw your boulders! Why are they throwing? Why did they stop chasing her? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Wait, what if she creates a second dam? 
with ice in Ice Dam. Okay, but the water levels are gonna rise significantly, yes? I'm no damn expert. I'm no damn expert. <laughs> uh, mm, okay. Oh God, do I gotta see a proposal now? Look at the sky. <laughs> Boring landscapes again. Sick. <laughs> They have endless space to go in now, and they're like, yeah, we're, we're fine just running in circles. You could have done that with the wall up. Oh my god, your sister's alive, and she's gonna remake Olaf. Because death isn't a real concept to Disney. Wait, wait, oh, hold on. The former king actually did die in the rebellion or in the fight? That's so dumb. That's gotta be the third one. Because what kind of villain is like, I'm gonna concoct this plan, and then dies in the first leg of that plan? Did you find the fifth spirit? You are the fifth spirit! You are the fifth spirit. I fucking knew it. Well, actually, a bridge has two sides, and Mother had two daughters. Oh, she's a new queen. You look different. Did you cut your hair or something? <laughs> oh, you know the concept of a haircut, huh, mullet boy? Oh my god. I never saw this coming. Olaf's alive again? Ah. Or is this putting us in mortal danger situation going to be a regular thing? No, we're done. We're done? Are they confirming there's going to be no Frozen 3? Will you marry me? <laughs> no! Yes! God, Anna, you just saved a goddamn kingdom. You could do so much better. I took an oath to always do what's best for Arendelle. I know just what that is. Yeah, okay, so I figured. She's gonna be queen, and then Elsa's gonna stay and be the leader of the new people. Queen Anna! Yeah, yep. Yeah. Was there one thing that happened in this movie that I didn't expect? Oh, great, he combed his mullet. I'm shocked you can last an hour. Hi, Gale. You named the wind spirit Gale? You son of a bitch. What are you gonna name the fire spirit, Blaze? Fuck out of here. Charades Friday night, don't be late. Oh, yay. Hopefully we get another charade scene. I swear to God, if I get another charade scene, I'm gonna quit forever. Elsa, be who you are. Oh, I will, Mama, I will. I live, and so do you. We live! <laughs> so dumb, so dumb. Who was the villain in this movie? Oh God, the story structure just needs so much help here. The villain would be their grandfather, who formulated a plan in the past and then just died accidentally. Okay, this was such a bad script. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and laughed along. Also, don't forget to go to audible.com slash Dylan is in trouble. Audible is a company that I'm very proud and happy to be working with. I will rep them for as long as they'll have me. It helps me out when you go and sign up and it's free. It's literally free for 30 days. Try it out. If you don't like it, cancel it. If you do like it, support them. Audible's a good company. With all that said, I'm gonna get out of here. I'll see you guys next time.